are four and seven teams battling it out on Monday night. I'm Tracy Wolfson and welcome to the Subway Post Game Show. Heading into the season, both the Jags and the Texans thought they would be fighting for a playoff spot, but instead they entered the game tied for last place in the AFC South. The Texans made the most of their first Monday night football game. Late in the second half, rookie Steve Slayton marched up to head coach Gary Kubiak, grabbed him by the shirt and said, let me run the ball. Kubiak listened and it paid off. Slayton with two fourth quarter touchdowns, including a 40 yard run. He racked up 130 yards on the ground and added two catches for another 52 yards. Slayton now has eight scores on the season, tying a rookie team record. Mario Williams, the first pick in the 06 draft, sacked Jacksonville quarterback David Garrard three times, one which caused a fumble and led to the other Slayton touchdown. Williams now has 11 sacks on the season. Texans quarterback Sage Rosenfels getting his fourth start in place of the injured Matt Schaub. He finished with 200 yards, a score, and an interception. The Jaguars' only touchdowns came with three minutes left to go in the game. Fred Taylor with a four-yard run, and Reggie Williams hauled in an 18-yard pass from Garrard. But Houston prevails 30-17 to for their second win in a row. The Jags fall to 4-8 and eight and have now lost five of their last six games. That's the Subway Post Game Show. I'm Tracy Wolfson. Have a great day.